Brian, James Smudgy Mitchell, who previously served on the Charlotte City Council, resigned to become CEO of a major construction company here in Charlotte, R.J. Leeper, and then recently won re-election to get his old job back, is not legally allowed to sit on the council. But here's the kicker. The city attorney, Patrick Baker, in an internal memo said the city has no plans to actually do anything to buy about it. And tonight he's actually getting sworn in. So I want to talk to you about the legality of all of this. The state law says a city council member can't own more than 10 percent of a company that does business with, with the city. So Mitchell has told Queen City News numerous times he owns 25 percent of R.J. Leeper, which does a ton of business with the city. So how exactly is Mitchell going to get sworn in with no consequences or at least selling his ownership of R.J. Leeper? Now, that's a question many city council members have asked the city attorney, Patrick Baker, but in his memo to the council, he said it's not up to him to take action. Now, as for how Mitchell plans on handling this, take a listen to an interview that I did with him just a few weeks ago when asking about his stake in the company. So my legal team told me I, I should not talk about that uh, at this current time, but rest assured I would do the right thing. What is the right thing? Uh, I, I think the right thing in my eyesight, you get below the 10% threshold, and so you won't violate what the state guidelines are. So one of the Charlotte City Council members told me that they have been questioning his ownership, and that's where that internal memo came from. But as for who's actually going to hold him accountable, I've heard that the State Bureau of Investigations and the DA's office would have the legality to either press charges or take some sort of action against Mitchell, against Mitchell for being sworn in and still owning 25 percent. And we know that the state law is pretty clear. If you own more than 10 percent, you're not able to sit on, a, on the Charlotte City Council. And he texted me right before our, our live shot right now. I asked him, is it true that you still own 25%? And James Smudgy Mitchell texted me back very clearly, yes, I still own 25% of RJ Leeper. So he's going to be getting sworn in tonight. So we'll have a full update for you on Queen City News at 10 on the swearing in ceremony and more. But for now, reporting live at the Government Center, Emma Withrow, Queen City News.